today we will be discussing tmap component which is available in talent data integration so tmap is like you know if you see if you are familiar with the data stage it's like a transformer object transformer thing. so where you will be doing most of the operations here so if you want to derive if you want to do some functionality on dates strings and if you want to join uh, between two uh, streams so you will use the uh, tmap let me show you uh, example how we will work with this and i have a sample data over here just two files again one is employee which is having id name salary department and then department num uh, department uh, text again uh, which is having department number and uh, department name so here what my requirement is let's join this department number from uh, two files and then uh, get the department name from the department text so i will be demonstrating joins in the map so also i will introduce how you can uh, perform multiple operations in tmap so that you can uh, explore on yourself so let me create first one job in talent tutorial that we have created for our uh, demo purpose i am creating a standard job and tmap Now you will be able to see a uh, workspace and then on the right side uh, palette all the components available. So let me drag quickly two delimited input files because right now I don't have any database installed. MySQL is available but it is disabled so that's why I mostly I'm working on flat files. So working from database is also similar only. So what you need to uh, understand here is how to use tmap that's all. So let me get another uh, delimited file let me quickly set these properties one is employee.txt and the separator is of course comma from both files okay and header plugin here one and then schema i need to give so actually uh, there is a repository schema also available let me connect that so if you select this repository option you would be having one option to browse so i have created metadata here for uh, uh, making it simple so i'll be selecting metadata from existing metadata so for that you have to select this metadata here and then you can add your own uh, schema so it's not uh, uh, good practice to every time you know edit these columns so all the columns will be imported to your uh, schema now i will be editing other uh, file also this is for department let me name it as a uh, one second okay no problem let, let, let's see later okay now it is other one delimited file this is departments okay again I already told built in means you are manually editing here repository means you will create here uh, metadata and then you will use it for your uh, uh, jobs okay now you are done with your data sources one is employee and other one is department now let's drag tmap See here one is main and other one is lookup which means this is the main one this one will be the reference kind of thing so you will see the dot 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 okay now i will use delimited output file here and then connect it from tmap yeah new output you need to you will ask like uh final 
so when you double click this when you double click this yeah this is the final output okay this this particular row one is nothing but this is from employee data and this one row two is nothing but from department now if you want to create any uh, variables variables nothing but if you want to create any intermediate columns you have to create it here let me first join these two uh, and then populate it into the output delimited file so here if you see eid e name salary department number and department id department name available now if you see here department number and department name let me select this and then drag it here department you see it is connected it is connected and row one of department number department id and if you see here there is a tmap setting when you click this you can see here left outer join join model left outer join and if you check this button you will have inner join and left outer join so for time being i will use left outer join only so once you're done with this you can select From here I don't want department ID I'll just drag the department name okay. this, this should go to one more second uh, this will go to this will go to department number like that so you will be getting one line right so like that if you get line means you can drop it directly now all columns from employee and the only one column from uh, you can minimize this okay. one column from department table you are mapping it to here now apply yes click ok yes done so in the file delimited output if you see here click on the edit schema now you will see all the four columns from the first file employee file and then department name just click ok and then browse this to save into output directory let's see tmap and the delimiter i will provide files number and delimiter data and then now let me run this Yes. So five rows, three rows. Since it is a left outer gen, five rows have been passed to final delimited output. Now we will go to this T sample. Oh, I have built, I think, maybe by mistake. Right. Yeah, completed. Now let's verify this. Tmap sample, why it is jar file. Let me verify it again. Oh, compress as G file. No need this. Include header. That's why. So by mistake, I clicked on compress G file. That's why it is compressing. It is not required for us to compress. Yeah. 
yes now let's verify here again yeah t sample edit so you see here employee names are already permanent along with the department that are matching and these two are not getting because there is no such department available and if you put here and if you put if you modify this mapping settings here and then left out regenerate if you change this and make it inner join so only matching columns will be passed apply so there is nothing uh, much in changing here okay let me delete this uh, The error means let me connect this okay go to advanced settings here throw an error if file already exists i should remove that and then relaunch it Yeah, completed. Now we will see here TMAP sample. So, as you can see, only matching columns, sorry, inner joints that are uh, uh, having common key only populated here. So, this is how we will do joints. And then let me create one more uh, thing here. So, I will be adding one variable and I will name it as a monthly Here categories there are many categories content so you can use here okay numeric relational sql like string handling everything so for now very basic computation row one this is this is a row one dot salary divided by 12 i'm using 12 and then i'm naming it as a monthly sal and let me convert this to uh, flow tag double sorry flow tag this will become flow okay now you have to drag this changes have been done right so let me apply those click ok and yes this will be another row for final delimited if you see just now we have added monthly salary so now the column has been propagated here now let me run it again cancel it run Yeah, the data has been loaded and only three rows because we have restricted it to inner join. Yes. Yes, of course. If you see here, monthly salary. We are dividing it salary by 12. So this is it for uh, this session. This is TMAP and you can use lots of functionalities using TMAP. So please do subscribe. I'll be posting more videos on talent. Thank you.